bro, then we can't talk. No. The fuck I make it shake, what? like a shake weight. Make it break, like an earthquake. Break the bank. If I put this work in it, you gon' cut me a Birkin. What's good, YouTube? I'm back at it again with another video. As you can tell by the title of the video, what I'm about to get into. Um, If you are a new person on my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button and turn my post notifications on so you don't miss anything and if you are a returning subscriber thank you thank you thank you so much make sure you share my videos with your friends so they can become subscribers and become of my family just like you yeah so um today i'm going to be doing an unboxing and i'm also going to be talking to you about one of the vendors i use and yeah we're just going to we just gonna get straight into the video. Uh, my unboxing is gonna be of uh, the lip gloss kit that I ordered and also of uh, my business cards from Vista Print. I'm so, so, so very excited that I designed for myself. Um, yeah, also hit me up at Amaria Creations underscore. It's gonna be right there. Um, if you need any help with um, logos, um, website designs, business card designs, um, flyers, banners, intros, outros, any of that, hit me up because I'm your girl. Okay, now let's get into the video. Um, I'm going to do my Vista Print cards first because I'm most excited about those. Um, my mo my kit lip gloss kit that I ordered from Mocha P, um, I opened it already just to see if um, everything was in and everything was. I opened my syringe because I wanted to smell it. Is that weird? Like, I love the smell of new stuff. So, like, my syringe... <laughs> that was in my lip gloss kit. I opened the pack just to smell it. Anyways, yeah. So the um true unboxing is gonna be on my Mr. Print um cards. Let's get right into it. Y'all, these packages sometimes be so hard to open. I really feel like I, I mean they're just trying to make sure our stuff is okay and that it gets to us right. But like this isn't one of them by the way. This is one I can open straight. But like, when I received my eyelashes from my vendor, it was wrapped up so freaking much. I basically had to tear the whole box up to get to my um, eyelashes. And I feel like that, that's a lot. Um, I ordered these from Vistaprint for, I think it was $49. Here is something a pamphlet or whatever i can't remember how many i ordered if i ordered 500 or if i ordered thousand but here they are this is what okay let's get started y'all i'm so excited this right here is like heaven 25 percent off Oh my god oh my god these are so freaking beautiful okay so here's the front it has smooches by Marielle on it and here's the bag with all my contact information on it and I am so freaking oh, taken aback by these cars like they're so beautiful and I took I took a um risk by making them on my own. I was like, you know what? I'm not gonna pay anybody to design my cars whenever I can do it for uh, for free. And so I got on there and played around with it. And yeah, I ended up designing my own cars. And I'm freaking thankful that I did because I could do it and they're beautiful. And um, yeah. Also a tip, something I seen on Facebook for you guys that have small businesses and would like to get off the ground um, I seen on a post whenever you're in Walmart and in public places like that to airdrop, um, upload your um, your business card in your gallery and airdrop that to everybody in the place that you're in. You know, everybody has iPhones now. Not many people have Androids. Um, shout out to my iPhone users, gang gang. Um, but not many people have Androids. So if you airdrop your business card, um, yeah, most likely almost everybody will get it. I think I ordered a thousand. I'm not sure. I'm really not. Here goes another 20% off. Um, I'll put them in that sideways. Uh -oh. Y'all, I am so freaking in love 
with my cards and my freaking coupons because I'm gonna need those if I don't figure out how to make how to do it myself. Um, I think I'm gonna figure out how to do how to make cards um, myself, so I won't have to spend so much making um, ordering from Vista Print. I'm getting this trash like I got somewhere to put it. Okay, so y'all, this is what uh, uh go. This is what my um, order from Mocha Pete came in. Um, so this is how it came. Packaged up like this with this little tie on it. And y'all, to be completely honest with you, even without the coronavirus being around, you still need to Lysol your product whenever you get it because you never know where it comes from, who'd have been touching it. They could have been digging in their nose and that's nasty. So, yeah. So this is the syringe I was telling you about that I opened. It's 60 milliliters. Um, yeah, and I opened it just to smell. I'm not gonna pull it out for you because I don't have any um, gloves on. Here goes the pipettes that came with the lip gloss kit. Uh, here you go, the pipettes that came with the lip gloss kit. Yeah. Um, this is I forgot how much this is, 5.5. This is a 5.5 ounce um, bag of lip gloss base, which I already already have um, several of, but it's good to stay stocked up on lip gloss base if you make um, lip gloss, especially during this time, because like if I didn't have any lip gloss at all, I wouldn't be able to make um, lip gloss, you know, to ship out my orders and that doesn't fly. So make sure you're stocked up, stocked up on lip gloss. Here is her card. Not gonna do too much advertising. I'm about to tell you why. Um, here goes ten. I think it's ten. Yeah, ten um milliliter tubes, squeeze tubes with the tops, and there goes um several pack of glitter. And it also came with this. Can you guys see it? Strawberry flavor. And so, you guys. I like the items and it came with everything it said it was going to come with but the only bad part is is that Mocha P took literally forever to get me my order. I actually purchased this on the 8th I believe but um so I got my confirmation on March 9th and so um I'm going to show you guys what I ordered. This is what I ordered. And please do not see this as advertising you guys because it's not. I would not recommend Mocha P. I would not recommend her because it takes way longer than the expected date. In my emails, it says it's supposed to be two to six days. But I received my order today. And today is April 6th. And I ordered March 9th. Or the order was confirmed March 9th. So this is what I ordered right here. Like I said, I got everything that I was supposed to in, in it. Um, yes, so the price of it is $44.99, but with shipping and everything, I paid 48 something, I believe. And so I pay almost $50 to be waiting on an order for, um, a whole Now, month. don't take this as a bashing session at all. It's just that my email literally says two to six business days and I received my order a whole month later. Um, if I was only ordering from her as a vendor, I would literally be short um, because it took her a whole month to get my stuff. And so I text her and basically said, hey, what's up with my order? So she proceeds to tell me that it's seven to 14 business days. So I'm like, okay, I waited out. Um, I email her again the next week. I say, have you got the order sent out? You know, I really need my stuff. She's like, I can give you half a refund i'm like no if you're gonna give me just half of a refund and i pay 250 dollars i need all my stuff just send it so she tells me after that that the orders have been shipped so i have the tracking on the order and yeah it said that it was in texas so i'm like fine it's on the way um, and so and come to find out it really wasn't so that next week i still had not received my order so i texted her on instagram again and basically said like what's the hold up she proceeds to tell me that she has been out of town for her birthday and i'm like 
you've been out of town for your birthday and I placed my order a long time ago. Like either you should have got my order before you went or our orders, because I know several people order from her. You should have got our orders before you went. Or, I mean, you should be working on that as soon as you get back. You have customers waiting on stuff. And she told me that she posted on several um, um, occasions that she was going out of town. I'm like, okay. But I, I, I personally didn't think that it would affect, you know, me a whole month out. So, I asked her, I said, when did you ship it? You know, you told me one minute, I mean, one week that you shipped it that day. Um, then you told me it would be out that weekend or something like that. And so I asked, when did, when, when have you, when did you ship it? ship it? She said, today. So you've been telling me for the past three weeks that you shipped my order and my order is on the move whenever it really hasn't left your house. No, that's, that's not good business etiquette. Um, that's not professional at all. And yeah, it's just her, her shipping time period is just a lie because she took so long to get my order and oh my I put screenshots into my video to let you guys know that I am legit and I'm not you know just making up a story to bash her name this is not a bashing session this is just for all of my small businesses that are around or lip gloss businesses or clothing business or whatever that use mocha pee as a vendor or or trying to use mocha pee as a vendor this is just a heads up she literally takes forever on the orders and she is unprofessional. She lied to me and told me on several occasions that my order was on the move or that she had shipped my order when she hadn't shipped it. And I understand things happen. Of course, you went on vacation for whatever reason. People go on vaca vacation. But at the same time, you know, I'm asking my progress of my order and you're lying to me. I don't like that and I spent $50 on you. And you were actually gonna have a good customer that was gonna keep coming back because the stuff, is nothing wrong with my stuff, it just took forever to get here. And so yeah, you pretty much lost out. I am a person that pretty much takes pride in the money that I earn because I really work hard for my money. And when I spent $50 with you or, and you aren't having no promptness about getting me my order, like that really, makes me angry it makes me angry when if i ordered the same day from multiple vendors that same day i ordered from multiple vendors meanwhile i've had all my stuff for weeks from them and you're just uh just i don't know what it, what it is lollygagging or you had a bad month i have no idea but do you guys do not take me showing her website on my video as promotion because it is not I'm telling you not to order from her if you want your stuff promptly. Now I'm just pretty much putting everything up. I have my pipettes right here. Um, I have my lip gloss making material right there. So I'm gonna put my pipettes right there. I also have my flavoring one right there. Um, so that's where I'm gonna put that. I have the lip gloss paste that just came in the lip gloss kit. I'm going to put that in here with all uh, my other lip gloss bases um, I have my tubes right here along with a lot more tubes um I have my syringe my syringe is gonna go in with my lip gloss making stuff of course and just my business cards um to end with Ooh, I had to take that jacket off because it got so, um, yeah, I just want to thank all of you guys for watching all my videos and asking questions on all my social media, giving me videos to do. Um, I want to do an inventory haul whenever I get my huge Amazon order. Um, quarantine has everything backed up. Not quarantine, I'm sorry. The coronavirus has everything backed up. And so I ordered on March 26th and I have Amazon Prime, but like it's still not here. And it says I'm going to be waiting until April 18th. So, um, I am going to be doing a huge inventory haul. I guess not huge. It's going to be like seven, eight items. But it's huge to me because it's going to be um, all that I'm ordering for a long while. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to do an inventory haul whenever I get my items. And, yeah, I just want to thank all of you guys for your continuous support. And, yeah, make sure you stop shouting the lot of that. Shout smooches, period.
Bye.